I got this long sleeve shirt on. It's so weird that it was freezing, below freezing, and now it's hot today. That's weird. But anyway, um, but yeah, she about to leave because it's too hot. Man, I told on you. No! That's what we're doing out here, cleaning up. So I want to see um, what ask. If anybody, that's stupid. Why am I doing that? I don't know. This is just something I thought was interesting. I'm not asking the question. I thought it was interesting. All right, we cut this top and you know, all that's a dead stuff. We're cleaning them up. But anyway, um, so the top got cut, the main broccoli stalk, like that. But, as you go down, it kind of laid down, and look at this. Another stalk from the main part is in the elbow, and it's making another broccoli head. So it'll keep growing and keep making more if you don't cut them down afterwards. So this is another stalk under here, but it doesn't have a head yet. But anyway, look at that. Cool, huh? Little baby broccoli. This was me trying to preserve them. Obviously that didn't really work. I wrapped them up and everything. It didn't really work though. But it's okay. I'm sure the roots are intact, so we'll see. It's kind of odd though, like this one was a cutting. Look how green it is, it's, it's, it lives. But this one was the main one and it died. But I'm assuming the roots probably intact down there. Let's see. Yeah, see, look at that. This is a different color here. I'm going to cut it, all that right there. You talking to me? Oh. I'm going to cut it. Right there. See, it's a different color. So I got to cut this thing all the way. But it grew this much, all this, this year. So, and it was way more than that. So that should be fine. Stuck me. So I'm gonna cut it and we'll see if it grows back next year. I don't worry about much. I just take things as they come. Look, it's a, like a stick in there. Oh, well, I cut it so you can see. Oh, shoot. I cut it wrong. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> but look, see, it's a stick in there. Wow. Yeah, I never knew it was an actual, it's a stick, like a branch. I never grew, never knew it grew like that. So it's a stick. So, yeah, just a stick. But this is all the fleshy part, I guess, you know? Hmm. That's so weird, it's just a little stick in there. That is weird. It's pretty cool and nasty. It's a jelly. Why are you touching it? It was fun. Oh, goodness. Anyway, but oh, I, thought I, I wanna cool. touch it too, then. Mm-hmm. Ooh, it's jelly. It's like aloe. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's like That's an so aloe. Weird. Okay, cool, yeah. But Ella probably don't have a stick in there, huh? I don't think Ella had a stick like that. But anyway, yeah, cool. Look at this skeleton. See that? It's like a, a suit of armor. It's weird. It's this little armor suit. Interesting. Put that back in there. Good nutrition. So, I don't know if Brandon mentioned, but these beds right here are all going to be for cut flowers. Because uh, that's my thing. <laughs> anyway, so I have some things that are already coming up. But look, I'm trying a new flower called Fritillaria. And they are coming. So, I'm very excited about that. It's going to be a really pretty flower. And these down here are gonna be ranunculus and they're spring flower as well 
And then, I don't know if you can see that, but these are gladiolas. They're perennial here, so they keep coming back. I'm not sure what color these are. I have several colors. And this is going to be uh, a flower called Love in a Mist. I'm not sure exactly what it's going to look like, but it's going to be pretty, I'm sure. And then, oh, right here, around this little dying kale is some more glass. And I actually just bought, like, a lot more <laughs> that I got to plant tomorrow. Oh. Yeah. Uh, thought you said something. Nope. All right, these are done for the most part. Just gonna leave it like this. They're gonna grow back though. They were just pretty much how they were when I um, bought them. Which is weird though. This was a cutting off that big part and it didn't freeze, but all the other ones did, so. But anyway, yeah, that's good. Yeah, Look at this, Jacqueline just showed it to me. I ain't been back here in a while, so I don't really pay attention to a lot of stuff. See that? dead well it ain't dead but look dead this is the guava it's not dead well i don't think it's dead but the leaves are pretty dead on it mm. enjoying your view whoa you saw that bird come right in front of you I know, because you think it's looking back. I need some binoculars. I can see. This ain't ours. I wish it was, but this is not ours. <laughs> yeah, this is, I think, a developer. It's coming in. Gonna come in and do something with this. Never know. We might be able to get a piece of it. Look at this. This is... Just like the other thing, a guava. I got from my friend John. He went and bought some special plants from uh, Texas. Muffin. Anyway, I knew it. She was gonna do. It. I knew she was gonna do it when I turned. What is it? A bug or a lizard? Anyway, this is a seedless guava. It's looking good. Looking big. And then I have another one. Another plant. That's the dead guava again. This is June Plum. And it's looking pretty harsh, I will say that. But it's still a plant there. June Plum. Yeah, they didn't do good with the cold. Oh, they just falling off. June Plum. It's okay, though. Let's take them all off then. Yeah, oh. Okay, there we go. What I'm gonna do is just plant some of these back in here. Cause that's kind of how trees and stuff work. The fruit falls and actually feeds the plant. And these ain't really edible, so I'm gonna put these back in here to feed it. Kind of push them into the soil a bit. I think this is going to do good. All our harsh cold is over with now, so. But jump them. 